is this won't set off any alarms. The fact that the building's totally empty. And somebody's using the elevator? Yeah, that's fine. It's normal. Marcus, first impressions on the data you sent me. Looks like Titus has the 10 year plan brewing in some kind of prototype lab. Aye, let's see what they're keeping in <laughs> sub level 6. And smash the shit out of it. What Wrench means is find and record evidence that Titus is up to something naughty. Of course, well, everybody's up to something technical. naughty. Sure. All the people are naughty. <laughs> No guards down here, huh? Alright, I'm in a nuclear bunker slash parking garage. You got anything else on the prototype labs? Only that there's one thick ass iron door in your way. No idea what's behind it if you get through. When I get through. When I get through. While the current Titus Watcher robots have limited offensive capability, we plan to fit them for a much more active role in conflict zones over the next several years. We are currently testing damage resistance within urban suppression contexts. Wow. We are also in negotiations with Galilei to build walkers for their space program. Those don't look like walkers. Those look like straight up um, killer robots. Killer robots indeed. All right, so does that power my Beep, boop, boop. Next presentation. Within the next two years, Titus will begin field testing assault and defense capabilities of our robots for use in both domestic and military situations. I hope I get one of these robots at the end. Featuring reliable accuracy and superior reflexes, our robots will provide safer alternatives to soldiers or security personnel. Term goals for Titus robots is to construct armor capable of withstanding the strongest ballistic attacks in a combat scenario. In domestic security situations, these new models will easily be able to withstand small projectile attacks, Molotov cocktails, and other improvised riot weaponry. People, I've recorded all kinds of ridiculous robotic shit down here. Here, you're not gonna believe it. Anything usable for the video? Titus and Bloom plan to put CTOS functionality into armed robots and use them against civilians. How does that sound? Yeah, all too familiar. What does that mean? Feeding big data through war machines was a wet dream of some of the blue concept grunts when we first were designing the CTOS. I made sure it got the veto back then. That's why you've been so involved with this one. Yeah, yeah, I had my suspicions. And now we've got the proof to burn them. Head on out. Not done here yet. More to see. I'll be in touch. There's more to see.
Thank you for watching this thing that we have in an underground bunker for some reason. I guess she, uh, the CEO, shows us off to the big wigs. Brings them down here and shows them how they're shooting robots and robots that can crush cars for the special clients in her life. Oh, this one. It'd be kind of nice if you actually, you know, get more tech as you complete missions. I'm not asking for a big giant killer robot, but you know, something like a wrench junior. Or an upgrade to my my RC car, my drone. Guys, guys, I can't even. Where'd you find? <laughs> oh, I can't even. Giant killer oh. spider. Do I get one of these? <sighs> Man, why does he get to play with all the toys? <laughs> Is there a oh shit face? Giant killer spider. Spider reproducing factory. Do I actually get to play with that, or no? That's just... I can't even run in here. That's weird. What does this do? System online. Exterminate. Destroy Titus's prototype lab. Alright, I think I got this beast all figured out. Just gotta get it through these security doors. Any ideas? Listen, if you knock out the fire suppression system, the doors should open as a failsafe. I can do that. Yeah. 
I might jump really high like that before. What was that? Robot Wars. the guards at me now. Please. Terrible targeting systems. Keep your I can walk on the walls? Oh, you son of a bitch. How did I not know that? I didn't know I could walk on walls. That makes things a whole lot easier now. Crazy. This is dumb. What is this? The angles are weird. Oh, I just ripped you to pieces. I ripped you to pieces, baby girl. So I don't get how you're supposed to do these ones that are on the ceiling. Uh, 
Uh, leave it to Watch Dogs to not give you a proper tutorial on anything. You're dead. Dozens of people shooting at me. Loss. Does this thing heal like I do? Where are these people coming from? This doesn't make any sense. There's no door here, is there? Function loss. Oh, I can go on the ceiling. Gosh darn it. Percent function loss. I destroyed that. It didn't work before when I tried to go on the ceiling. Oh, I want to play with this thing all day. That's it. Heading to the prototypes now. We've got a problem. Looks like the door to the backup servers is still closed. I'm on it. Knock the fuck out of the prototype while working the door. Counting on you, buddy. 75% function loss. Yeah, of course, like... Come in here. I dare you. 50% function loss. Alright, I guess she does heal, so that's good to know. Alright. Really? 50% function loss. Yeah, 50% function loss. Yeah. 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 like no splash range. What's the point of that? Can I go in 
here. No. I want to drive this thing all through town. Can you do that? I think San Francisco needs to see what this piece can do. Find your way up to the backup server room on sub level three. Can Who needs elevators? Now? Make sure you smash the shit out of everything. <coughs> All right, I'll smash the shit out of everything. There's gonna be more guards in here, right there. Going to chase. Sub level six. Controls are kind of weird, but this is still fun. Sub level three. I guess that's the size I can go, right? Just checking. Sure. And I'm gonna have to uh, do a suicide mission here. What am I doing? Break everything. Lots of things, if not everything. 
Now how am I gonna get out of there? How does Marcus hey, get out of there? What's going on in there? Uh, I don't know, man. Uh, way above my pay grade. Good, good luck. <laughs> well, that part was fun. The first part of the mission was fun. The third part of the mission was fun. That second part was a bitch. That was just brutal. And I only think ma I made it out because of bugs, honestly. Now what's happening? Yo, Marcus. Check out all this Titus shit. It is like engineer porn. Porn. I mean, machine learning, nanotech, railguns. Railguns? Yeah. Are you I gonna build me a railgun? Like that. No, probably not. This was a gift? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, damn, Ray. You're like some kind of greasy, foul mouthed Santa. Ho, ho, ho. Merry fucking Christmas. Hey, you guys ready? Sitara's about to release the vid. Their vids are boring. I said it. Compared to other Silicon Valley Titans, Titus goes unnoticed. They do not put effort into their public face. They operate behind closed doors, oh, see? away from That's why I never heard of before. DeadSec Pride, and what we found, should worry you. Titus is using your tax contributions to fund military-capable machines. Today, a combat prototype rampages through their own facility, demonstrating the destruction they can cause. Within the next ten years, these machines can be deployed on American soil. If you do not exercise your right to protest them now, they will build an army to keep you quiet and compliant. Titus has partnered with Bloom to grant CTOS access to their machines. Bloom has sold your private information and weaponized it to use against you, should this project continue. We will not stand idle while that happens. DeadSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. Come on, let's go see what you scored before you get all the pages all stuck together. Hey, I'll catch up with you later. All right, later.